was in school yesterday, kind of. Oh yeah, I was in school. I was supposed to have lessons, but I didn't, which was quite a good day, because I didn't do anything. But I was talking to this guy right here. <laughs> he said that donuts and bagel. We had some weird conversation. But he said that donuts and bagels are the same thing, and I was like, obviously, I was like, no, they're not. And then we had a big conversation about it, and I decided that I'd make a video about talking about it. I'd do some research, get some, and then do a video talking about donuts and bagels and how they're different, which is what this is going to be. So, I went to Asda, brought some bagels, because, you know, visual representation. Here's a packet to prove I'm not lying. So, yeah, I went to Asda, brought some bagels for the video, which was kind of a sad reason to buy, like, food, but, uh I enjoyed it, and then, so yeah, this tastes pretty much, if you've never had a bagel before, it tastes just like bread, it's just bread with a hole. You'd like, slice a hole, you'd slice it in half, spread butter or cheese or something, and then maybe add ham, lettuce, cucumber, that kind of thing, and then you just eat it, because it, it's quite nice. I've done some research on the internet, uh, of um on bagels, which was quite an interesting thing, really. It wasn't interesting to shit. I just went in my head. People could use these as sex toys. I mean, look at that hole right there. I'm sure you can see my head through the hole. That's... This is like a pervert's play thing. When you're not eating it, obviously. Apparently, these bad boys, they're the dough, which is made from um, yeasted wheat, is boiled, and then they bake it, and that's how you get the consistency. It's like quite chewy and quite hard. Um, also, another interesting little fact: apparently, that hole is so that when they um, when they're transporting them after they've been baked and stuff, they can like put a bit of rope through or something, and it makes them easier to transport. And also, when they're displaying them in like the proper bagel shops, you get they can make nice big displays. Now, we're going to travel from bagels to donuts. I'm not going to get a donut out and start eating it because I'm sure you've all eaten donuts at some time in your life. So apart from the main difference, which is obviously a donut is a donut and a bagel is a fucking bagel, the difference is that donuts are made up of the same stuff, but they're um, deep fried, whereas the bagel is baked. You call it a bagel, but no. But so yeah, so jam uh, donuts are deep fried and then they inject whatever into it, like jam, apple sauce, heroin. The history of the donut is that it was um, a Holland, a Dutch food, I guess. And it, yeah, it was Dutch. They had it over in Holland for a while. And then they took it over to America and obviously when you get to America, the general stereotype of America is really fat, donut-eating people. They're, like, eaten by fucking nearly in every country they're eaten in some shape or form. And what else can you say that for? What else is eaten around the world? Seriously. I've changed the lighting again because my face looked, in the other clips, it looked too bright, that's the word. So I pulled my curtains, my dark black curtains because I'm a total goth like that and I'm trying to get the balance between black and white right I'm like the mediator between good and evil light and dark <sighs> fucking Sora and Riku who can't sort the fucking lights it's pissing me off like get <laughs> the guy Reese that I made this whole video for he um he argued yesterday when we were having the whole bagel donut conversation. He said that if you get a bagel, put like some sugar on it, put some sprinkles and some chocolate, you've got a donut. And obviously that's not true. So that's why I've made this video to find out the differences, which as we can now see, they're made differently. One's deep fried, one's baked. Come from different countries eaten by different people, although I'm sure Jews eat donuts as well, probably, unless donuts have meat and 
don't you all feel that much smarter now that you know the difference, the very clear difference between bagels and donuts? I don't really know what to say now, I'm kind of running out of things to talk about, which is really bad, I need to get better at this, and I know I will in time. I've got nothing left to do, so I think I'll just say bye in a really manly voice. Here it comes. Three, two, one, bye.